Tony. How dare you point that thing at me? Stop with the emotions. You don't love me. You love what I represent. You love being the... Dude, do you even have a penis? Or are you one of those hermaphrodites born without genitals? Tricks up our sleeves, huh? <laughs> oh, I'm just a nightclub singer with a broken heart. I you still suck love you, Tony. Hold on to yourself. You're in over and your head you and you're up there. you doing? Nothing. Really? Because I keep hearing a math for that this, a cop that. Go away. What? You know, go watch your linear entertainment. Go watch porn. Just go away. Shit. Fuck you. What the fuck? You disrespectful little asshole. I can't believe you did that. That's my TV. You don't talk to me like that. I can't believe you. Mom was right about you. You don't know any better and you can't help it, but you're an asshole. Yeah, well, why don't you do something then? Besides, just stand there. Why don't you hit me? Is that what you want, to be hit by your son? Yeah. No. I just want you to do something. Besides, sit there, eating. Yeah, great. Thanks for the fucking guidance, Dad. It means a lot. Wait. I'm just trying to help you. Yeah, well, nothing says I love you like smashing my fucking TV. Nothing at all. I'm sorry. I just wish we could do things together. Yeah, what things? I don't know. Uh, go for walks. Play ball. You know I have bad glands. Yeah, bike ride, then. Bike ride? You want to go on a fucking bike ride? Fine, fine, let's go on a fucking bike ride. We'll take a bike ride along Vespucci Beach, and I'll show you just what you want to see. This day was going so well until you showed up, you know that? Ugh. Yeah, well, you're lucky to even be allowed out of the house after that boat stunt. What's the big deal? If anything goes wrong, you can just fake your death and start all over. I'm going crazy listening to this crap. Station change. Oh, hell yeah. How am I meant to develop my own moral sensibility when yours are so... when yours are so unbelievably fuck-based? Help push me. Seriously, some guys borrow your bow. Borrow? You were hiding in the head crying kidnap. They just took receipt of your property with payment pending. If it was anything other than what you told me, then that's on you. All right. They fucking stole it. And who knows what they would have done if they found me. But I didn't expect or want them to get killed. You think I'm gonna let some guys ride off with my son? Look, I knew you were a bad guy, but... Oh, a bad guy. A crook, a killer, a thief, a liar. I guess I've been all those things one time or another, right? It's just... Shit! It's just... What? I always thought... I was the good guy. God help the morally bankrupt planet your generation have left us if you're the good guy. Yeah. Anyway, I always knew you were the kind of person who didn't let other people get in the way, but I hadn't, like, seen that happen. Oh, man! I hadn't, like, seen that happen before. Yeah, well, that's me, Jim. And I've been trying my best to get things under control for the last ten years, but that was an extreme fucking situation, and I had to act. A normal person wouldn't have done that. Yeah, well, I had to. To protect you. Yeah, keep telling yourself that when you see their faces every time you close your eyes. the bike rental place. Please don't shoot the bike rental guy out of, like, force of habit. Hey! Hello? Hey, you! Two bikes. Take your pick. I had a great time the other night. Bet you did, too. Yo, thanks.
If I make it to the end of the pier first, you're gonna buy me a big ass new flat screen. <sighs> end of the pier? All right. But if I beat you, you're gonna behave like a human being. Give it up, Dad. You've got to see. In this kind of condition, a triathlon would kill me. I'd never bike with the man who murked my flat screen. I forget me enough. Give up, even though you're losing. If you like the beach so much, bury yourself out here. You're a sore loser. Looks like you're buying your own TV. You know, this is real nice, Dad. Bonding, good times. Yeah, yeah, I'm giving it my best shot. Come on, we're having fun, right? You wouldn't know fun if it sat on your face. Ah, come on. I mean, why do I have to hold your hand through this whole midlife crisis bullshit? And why don't you stick your nose up Tracy's butt sometime? Because Tracy doesn't buy cars she can't afford, so that thugs break in our house. Tracy doesn't get kidnapped or destroy my yacht.